It's time right now for our another edition of Chipping Around the Grand Strand. And this week, future Masters champion and meteorologist Scotty Powell is going to show you how to hit the perfect shot on those breezy days. We're here at Presswood Country Club with my buddy Jay Smith here. And Jay, sometimes we're on the Grand Strand playing golf. And you know how that ocean breeze can kick up and we may need to keep our ball a little bit lower or you may have mishit your driver just a little bit and you're on the edge of the fairway, you're going to teach us how to keep those shots a little bit low today. Yep, I'm going to. And as you can see, the wind's blowing right now. So sometimes you got to keep the ball down to make it, to make the shot better for you. You want to keep it out of the wind because the higher it gets, the wind will knock it down. It may end up short and you don't want to end up in a bunker. That's right. So Jay's going to show us here in just a second. We talked about Got some wind in my face, I need to hit a low shot. That's the right shot for this for this hole. There's water I gotta go over or a bunker and I don't wanna hit it way up in the air and have it come back to me. So the first thing I'm gonna do is, say normally I'd hit an eight iron, well I'm gonna go down to a seven iron. I'm gonna choke down a little bit on it. I'm gonna play it in the back of my stance, move my hands a little bit forward, and then when I come through, I'm gonna stop my hands. I'm gonna do an abbreviated follow through. So. First thing I'm gonna do, choke down, well, I'll take one more club, choke down a little bit, put it in the back of my stance, make sure I'm lined up properly, and then do an abbreviated follow through. And hopefully hit them all just like that. Well, Jay, that was a great hit there. So what you said is you wanna club down, so I also have my seven iron. And so we're going to get in our original stance, and then what do we do from there? So we're going to back it up in our stance, okay. right there, hands just a little bit forward, just like that. And then when you come through, you're, you're going to do an abbreviated follow through. Just don't follow through the whole way. Do about a one quarter follow through. And it may feel a little weird, but that's okay, right? Yeah, because you're trying to flight the ball down. Okay, so let's see how it goes. Well, Jay, that was perfect. That's something for me. I, I like to keep the ball a little bit low just because we have those yeah. gusty winds here at the beach and sometimes I find my ball on the edge of the fairway. So I'm going to let you give us those tips one more time so those folks who may find themselves out on a windy day, how they can keep the ball low. Okay, so the first thing is if I think I'm going to hit an eight iron, go down to a seven iron. Choke down on the club a little bit, ball position in the back, and when you follow through, stop your hands. That's perfect. So for those windy day golf days, those are your tips. Back to you in the studio.